Hello everyone. So, uh, as you know from the Andrews textbook, we've come to this equation here. dp over d is equals negative rho g. This is an equation of hydrostatic balance. And what we're going to do in this lecture is then use that to calculate the pressure scale height equation. As you can see, as you'll see in a bit, the pressure decreases from some high value of the surface. And the atmospheric pressure decreases exponentially. And we'll show that in an equation while also deriving a quantity called the, the scale height, which is shown here. But for uh, what we would need for this derivation is to use the ideal gas law, which is what this is. This is a form of the ideal gas law. PV equals NKT. It's just a number of different ways of writing the ideal gas law or the equation of state. This is one way of doing it. Uh, N is like the number of particles in the atmosphere. So you can divide V on both sides and get this uh, N over V term here. Um, so you have uh, numbers per number of particles per meter cubed. And what we want to do is get rid of that row expression. So uh, we're going to get to terms of pressure. So that N over V that I just mentioned, that's number of particles per meter cube, is the same thing as the density divided by the mass. So it's you know kilograms per meter cube divided by kilograms, and you get the particles per meter cube. So this is what this is. You can rewrite this in terms of rho, uh, rho in terms of Pm over Kt. And what we're going to do is plug this back in there this equation, but before we even do that, we're going to divide both sides here by dz. So you're left with uh, dp is equal to negative rho g dz, just another way to do this equation. Divide both sides by p, you'll see why in a second, it's a nice little trick. Negative rho g dz over p. And then uh, we're going to plug in for rho, P M over K T G P D Z. Alright? So what we're gonna what's gonna happen here is that the P's cancel. And you're left with then let me just that negative M G over K T D Z. And you can see right away that this is the same thing as uh, 1 over HA, or 1 over the scale height, is what we've derived here. Uh, so uh, we can simplify this again. It's equal to negative uh, DZ over HA. So now we can uh, integrate both sides. They say from not 0 to 1 not from you know some value of pressure near the surface and then once some value up above and what you have then is a natural log of uh, p1 over p0 is equal to uh, negative uh, you know uh, z1 minus z0 and then you get um, basically z0 minus z1 and, and all this, and so what you can really do is just simplify this into just calling this uh, delta z, right? That's just the z1 minus z0 term. Uh, and then what the next step would be would be to take the exponential of both sides, so you get rid of the natural log, and what you're left with is we're almost there, p1 over p0 is equal to uh, and by the way, it's a negative term here. Um, uh, P1 over P0 is equal to uh, exponential of negative delta Z over HA. And then uh, we're, we're there, basically. P1 is equal to P0 exponential of negative uh, delta Z over HA. So this is the pressure scale height equation, which will give you, basically says that pressure decreases in, in, in an exponential fashion. But there's a weird exception about this equation that we're going to talk about in the next video.